The Lafayette City Parish Councils are officially starting budget hearings and over the next two months the budget will be scrutinized before coming up for final adoption in September. Chris Welty joins us live from over at LCG with a recap from today's hearing. Chris. Hey Jim, Lafayette Mayor President Josh Guillory's proposed budget is $21.8 million less than last year's budget. Today, Chief Financial Officer Lori Tubes gave a presentation to the Joint Councils and said that today is like the opening ceremony of the budget process. Tubes says that LCG has used about 18 million of its fund balance so far, which is about one third of the fund balance. And if LCG makes no changes and keeps its $18 million spending, then at the end of the three years, the LCG fund balance will only be at $1 million. LCG is predicting that parish sales taxes will be down 25% compared to last year. As we know, the mayor president is proposing deep cuts in parks and recreation and community development. Following cuts in the community development department, several entities were left with only one employee on the payroll for the fiscal year 2020-2021. Whenever we have to make tough decisions, it, it, it's, we're reminded as leaders how directly, here on the local level, how directly our decisions impact those that we are blessed to serve. I do not take that lightly. I know our CFO does not take that lightly and our CAO and the administration, but also these council members don't take it lightly either. The Lafayette City and Parish Councils will hold a joint meeting on September 10th to adopt the final budget. And if you'd like to see a calendar for the budget review process, you can head over to our website, KTC.com. Live in Lafayette, Chris Welty, KTC TV3.